JD was always um, staying in touch with me, um, he always checking up on me um, during the preseason and seeing if I had any clubs yet and I had no offers yet so JD got me a meeting with Wayne in December. Yeah it was pretty confronting uh, meeting Wayne but you know he was just straightforward. Yeah he told me he'd let me know. Probably a month later JD called me up and asked me if I wanted to come in for training trial and told my family I was stoked and I'll be starting with South so as a trainer troll. Delay drives the Sharks back almost to the 10 metre line. I missed the first few games because I just got injured, returning from COVID and then managed to get back on the field and string a few games together. Probably like after my fifth or sixth game, they offered me an extension for three years, so yeah. Biggest inspiration in my life would have to be my partner and my parents. You know, they sacrifice a lot um, off the field for me, you know, um, just to um, um, just to, um, you know, help me become the man that I am today. Um, you know, they've told me a lot of things. They've helped me along the way. And um, yeah, they're my biggest inspirations. Both from Tonga, they came young, you know, to start a new life. They gave me every opportunity to get to where I am. You know, mom always working hard, dad always, um, taking me to trainings and stuff, always helped me become a better player and also a better man. So, you know, I owe a lot to them. And also my partner, who's always keeping me in check every day at home, you know, with the kids and stuff. She's been like the best. She's always there for me whenever, like I look to lean on someone, like whenever I'm down, you know, she's always picking me back up, um, giving me things to do. Also, just with the kids, always taking care of the kids whenever I'm like not in the mood, you know, like just being that helping hand for me, especially off the field. Yeah, she's been a massive part of my life, and I'm forever grateful for her.